606 right now. A plan is now in place to start getting some students in Anne Arundel County back inside their classrooms. The school board approved a hybrid reopening plan on Wednesday that starts with the district's youngest students coming back next month. WMR News Megan Knight is outside the Anne Arundel County School Board headquarters in Annapolis. And Megan, a lot of teachers showed up there last night to protest this reopening plan. Yeah, that's right, Christian. They had a big caravan that drove past the uh, Anne Arundel County School Board building here off Riva Road in Annapolis. Uh, they had their signs. They had their chants protesting this plan to get teachers and students back into schools. Now, this plan will start to bring in students with early childhood intervention or ECI as well as pre-K through second grade uh, in mid-November. The students would only be in school for a couple of days a week on a rotating schedule and then do virtual learning for the remainder of the week. Teachers at the rally last night say they're just concerned about being able to follow CDC guidelines to keep themselves and the students healthy and safe. I weigh 80 pounds. If I get sick, I'm going to die. It's just not a feasible or safe environment for them. Now, the school board did approve that plan last night. Five to three was the vote. And the timeline for this is to have teachers back in the classroom by November 2nd. ECI pre-K through second grade students will be back on November 16th. Again, only going in a couple of days a week on a rotating schedule. And then third through fifth graders will return on November 30th. Now, parents can opt out of this if they would like to and continue to do virtual learning from home. Uh, they'll have to make that decision by October 15th. And the school board says it is continuing to work with the health department uh, to come up with a plan on how to get middle and high school students back inside the classroom. They're hoping to have that put in place sometime in mid-December. We're live in Annapolis. I'm Megan Knight, WMAR 2 News. Okay.